Continuing the conversation about what local voters are concerned about, child abuse, one of the biggest areas of concern. When asked how big of a problem it is in SA, 81% of respondents said it was extremely serious or very serious. Throw in the pandemic and the number of children who are at home more often, and the problem just worsens. It's why Jesse Degollado says child advocates in the city's largest school district are being proactive. These days, children so rarely being seen in the usual places is just what child advocates say perpetrators need to hide abuse. What this pandemic has done is it's created this environment for secrecy um, to really continue, and it's just the perfect storm. Locally, he says calls to the state child abuse hotline are down 30 percent. You know, our biggest fear is that we're going to have a child death on hand as a result of this pandemic because people aren't laying eyes on them. It's why with their students online, whenever Northside ISD teachers are checking on their progress, it's with a watchful eye. Really paying close attention to the nonverbals that you can see on a computer screen. So They're looking for virtual signs of possible abuse, keeping in mind the perpetrator may be listening. Is the child being hypervigilant or fearful, looking around the room, or any drastic changes in appearance? If so, out of an abundance of caution, Northside police can go by and check on them. So we want to really make sure that we are reporting what uh, what concerns and fears we may have for student safety. Thanks to virtual check-ins, she says Northside already has found quite a few possible cases of abuse. Jesse Degollado, KSAT 12 News.